I'm Paul Meissner and I'm the Senior Managing Partner of Carlson Meissner Hart & Hazlett. And I want to talk to you for just a minute or so about insurance and insurance companies. Good hands, good neighbors, acting responsibly. Millions of dollars spent over a long period of time for years to drill into your brain that the insurance companies are your friend. I say to you, talk to anybody who's been injured, disabled, or whose property has been lost in a hurricane or other natural disaster. Talk to someone who's had to deal with an insurance company in terms of making a claim for payment against that insurance company. They are more likely than not going to tell you that their best friend was not their insurance company, but in fact was their lawyer. Insurance companies operate for profit. Their existence and their performance is measured by collecting the most in premiums that they can legally collect and that the market will bear and paying as little out in claims as they can. Ask yourself what's fairer. Armies of lawyers available to multinational and multi-million dollar corporations who are on call 24-7 and who are paid for every second or every minute that they work for the insurance company. Or lawyers who are paid only if they prevail on behalf of their client. Who is more motivated to work aggressively and efficiently? Who do you think is the more inventive and imaginative? The longer an insurance company delays payment, even if payment is ultimately inevitable, the more that company makes. Lawyers to them are a cost of doing business, and that cost is factored in to the cost of their premium. How do you think an adjuster's performance is evaluated? By paying or not paying a claim? How do insurance companies evaluate their lawyers? Quick resolution of a claim or delay or denial in payment of the claim? Carlson Meisner Hart and Hazlett, helping the injured since 1971.